Hey guys, and welcome back to another one of my videos. So if you have multiple textures on your avatar or you want to have multiple textures on your avatar and the ability to switch in between them, like an example you see on the screen, today I'm going to show you how to do this. It is really simple. So the first thing you want to do, click on your avatar. On the right side, scroll down until you see parameters, select that. Let's add a parameter, call it whatever you want. You can do skin swap and you want to make sure that it's a float. Let's go on to our animator. In the layers, you want to click this little plus, name it the same. And in this little gear here, you want to make sure the weight is one. Go into the parameters here, click on plus, make sure that it's on float and you want to name it the same. The new layer that you created, you want to right click, create, form blend tree. Now you want to click back onto your avatar, go animation. If you don't see animation here, go window, animation, and then animation, it'll spawn right here. So you basically want to click here, go create new clip. You can name it skin swap, but if you have multiple, so let's say you have seven different textures that you want to switch in between, then I would go basically name them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven for each one. Basically, so you can keep track of which skin you're working on. So let's say I want to do 20, save. You want to hit play. And now you want to find the textures that you basically want to switch or the new textures. The way you would do it is you would just find the textures, drag them onto the avatar. If it for some reason doesn't work, you can uh, find the actual object that you want to replace the thing with. And once you find it, you're going to see on the right side here, the mesh renderer, you can just drag in the material in there and it will record it. Once you did that, you want to go on play preview, click on these little crystals, con go control C press here, control V, you want to hit preview again and project. And now basically you're repeating the same process again and again for however many materials you have. So if you have three, you're going to do this three times. If you have 20, you're going to do this 20 times. Once you have all your animations ready, they should look something like this and they're going to have the name, whatever you named it. So now let's head back to our animator into our blend tree. You want to click on it in this little window here, parameter is going to be whatever name you used. And you're going to go in this little plus and add motion field. And you're going to keep adding these to however many slots you have. If you have three, you're going to only use three. If you have two, you're only going to use two, etc. And you're just simply going to drag the animation into that. And however many you have, you're just going to drag them in here. And that's it. The final thing you want to do is click on your avatar, go down main menu. You want to add a control call it whatever you called it. In the type, it's going to be ragdoll puppet. And in the second parameter is going to be the parameter, whichever one you created. And now your animation works and you can switch in between the textures. Hope that this tutorial helped you out. Let me know in the comments if you got some questions and I'll see you around. Peace.